Hi, we are going to try a little math lesson here. I'm going to try this again. I did it once, but it was very out of focus. I hope this is better. Um, first, what we've got is our calculator. Let's clear, clear everything on the calculator. Okay, so we are going to do a little bit of sales tax calculating here. Um, what we've got is the first order here with Elsa for $29.99. And the glimmer sticks were four for $9.99. So we've got that written down there. $29.99 plus $9.99. We did this on the calculator. So it's $39.98. Just going to do this right here on the calculator for you. $29.99 plus $9.99 equals $39.98. Okay. So that's what we wrote here. $39.98. Then we have to add the 75 cent customer processing charge. So 39.98 plus 0.75 equals $40.73. So we have that as our total, $40.73. Now we have to figure out the sales tax. We're going to start with 8.875%. Everybody's sales tax is different depending on what state you live in, what county, what town. So we're going to start with this one, 8.875%. So you take your, your total, $40.73. Sorry, $40.73. I'm trying to do this without making everyone dizzy. $40.73. So we multiply that times the tax rate. So $40.73, which is what we already have here, times 8.875, which is the tax rate, percent. See that percent key? And that gives us the sales tax for this order, $3.61. You don't need all the rest of those numbers over there. Just the numbers after the decimal point there. See the little decimal point? 361. Okay? That's a 4, so we round down. If it was a 6 or 8 or 9, we would round up. But 361. So then we put the 361 over here for the sales tax. Okay? It's a little sloppy because I was trying to do this before with... Um, with the other, um, I tried to film it before, but it didn't work. Okay, so 4073 plus 361. So we got the 361 there already. We're going to add the 40 point, what did I do? Clear entry. <laughs> Sorry, the 361, and we're going to add plus the 4073, which was our subtotal, 40.73 equals... $44.34. How come that went up higher? It wasn't $44.34 before. It is $44.34. I did it wrong on the previous calculations. Okay, so $40.73 plus $361 is $44.34, okay? I hope that made sense. We're going to try this again with a different tax rate. I'm going to show you because not everyone is at 8.875. Some people are less. If you're lucky and you live in a different state, that doesn't charge as much as these folks here in New York. So again, we have Elsa, $29.99. Four black glimmer sticks, $9.99. Our subtotal is $39.98. Okay. We add the 75 cent customer processing charge. Just like on the other ticket, it was $40.73. Only this time... The sales tax is 7%. So we're going to do this. We're going to clear the calculator. I'm going to do 40.73 times, this time it's just 7%. And so the sales tax on this order is $2.85. So we wrote that there. We got the 40.73, $2.85. We're going to add 285 with the 40.73, and we get $43.58. Okay, 40.73 plus 285 is $43.58. That's how much the customer owes you, okay? I hope that helped um, with the sales tax. So um, I know math is not always easy for everybody. Some people, their brains just get a little scared when they see percent signs and everything. Um, so I hope that made a little bit of sense and I hope that helped you. All right. Have a great day.